Okay, we'll watch. We'll watch that one. I'm probably gonna have nightmares now, but it is what it is. Hold on, let me turn off the music. I'm having nightmares now, but hey, it is what it is. Concerned father Chris from Fargo, North Dakota says that his four year old son has been. Wait, let me get something to drink real quick. I'll be back. All right, let's get scared. Been behaving very strangely. Yeah, how's this kid he behaving? Says that bro? Over the last three or four days, the child has said that he just doesn't want to go in the bedroom because he says, "quote There is a monster in there." Of course. Obviously, Chris just dismissed these claims as a child's overactive imagination. I got Minute Maid lemonade around two in a can. The boy is fast asleep in bed. Sponsor me, Minute Maid. Something happens that Chris and his wife simply can't explain. Something <clears throat> truly shocking. Maybe I'll add a reaction channel or something where I react to this type of stuff. What is that? Is that his kid sitting in there? Oh, it's gonna. No! Huh? Boy cries out when he appears to get shoved out of bed by. He got thrown! Shoved! Shoved! Bro, homie got thrown! Force. Chris says that his son cried out in shock, but thankfully, the boy was okay and completely unharmed. Chris says that the previous owner of their house passed Shove. away right in the living bro, room. Bro, homie got fucking thrown. They, he yoinked them, bro. He got yoinked. He wonders if this tragic history has anything to do uh, with you see that? happening to their son. Wait, hold on. Does the door open at the same time? Or is it this tragic history has anything to do with what's happening? Okay, so... I think that's fake. Right? Like, there's a chance that could be fake, right? Well, either... But, okay, so either, like... Because if you look, like... Hold on. And he wonders if this tragic history has anything to do with what... Because when he gets shut, It's after he gets shut, though. So, which is... Maybe the fact that he hit the floor, it made the door crack open a little bit. It's happening to their son. Like, from the vibrations, you know? Hold the door. A woman Hold named Nadine has been experiencing Hold some door. very strange Hold and door. unexplained events in her home in Alabama. Of course it's Alabama. Here, get him. Get him, doggo. Show him what's up. Show him the what one, the what two. Give him that one two combo. Yeah, get him. Yeah, what's good? Now, good. many viewers believe that they can hear, hear a that voice whisper something after the dog barks that sounds he does. like I did hear that. lay over there. <laughs> Yeah, I heard that. I heard that. I just thought it was part of the off, like. But what do you hear, if anything? As for Nadine, she says that she's a skeptic and doesn't really believe in ghosts at all. I do. But then one night, she's looking after her two-year-old daughter Blake, and something happens yeah. that freaks her. Yeah. That right. You're not gonna believe in ghosts? This ghost's about to make you a believer, bro. You're about to you see okay? the light. Do you want me to go open the door? Why? No. Okay. 
Does it sucks for you? Okay, I I'm honestly freaking the f out and I don't know what to do. Just a couple minutes ago, I got up and I closed my door hey. because she kept pointing hey. to my room, saying, "Mommy, mommy, someone's over there." Yeah. And and she was terrified. She she was she was terrified. Of yeah, course, freaking terrified. me out. So I went over there and she, she just said, "No, scared. mommy, come here, come here, mommy, sit, sit, mommy, don't go over there." And yeah, her so I saving her the life dog right now. and I closed my door. And as you can see. Dude, she's still terrified. She's still terrified. She doesn't want me going over there. She doesn't want me open the door. Yeah, that's scary. I am... Dude, I'm terrified. Blakey, mommy's gonna go open the door, okay? Don't do that. I'll be right back. Don't do that. It's okay. Bro, listen to your kid, bro. Listen to your kid. They're there for a reason. I'll be right back. Don't do it. Nah, bro, I'm about to get- And now she's hiding her face. Dude, what the- Nah, I'm closing my eyes, boys. Chat, I'm closing my eyes. I don't- I don't want to see! I don't want to see! <sighs> it's okay, baby. No, it's not. Bro, that was the creakiest door ever! Oh! No, oh, no, 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 no. Okay, okay. Okay. Close the door, please. Okay. It's like, okay. did you see it? It's did you okay. see it? Fuck you! I don't want to see it. <laughs> okay, tell me I'm not. What do I do? Little two-year-old Blake is terrified of something in Nadine's bedroom. Blake. So much so that Nadine Blake. has to close the door to calm her daughter down. <coughs> so could it be that little Blake saw a supernatural entity, or just what yes. was scaring her? Let me know what you think. I mean, your dog's figuring out, your kid's figuring out. Alone, new things are known. Tasha D and her husband be, move into you know, an 1840 more farmhouse sensitive to the in upstate New York. The happy couple begins to renovate their new home. Yeah. But soon, Tasha begins to experience some very unsettling and unexplained events. Right. These strange incidents only seem to occur when Whoa. Tasha is home alone. So her husband is a bit skeptical. So one day, a picture frame in the house inexplicably falls to the floor. Tasha grabs her phone and starts to record in hopes of proving to her husband that something yeah. is just not quite right. Yeah, get that proof, lady. Quite right get that proof. In the old farmhouse. Sure, sure, See, what's up? You think I'm crazy? The first time I'm here by myself, there's a picture on the floor, and it just. No! Soon start to get even weirder. Nah, he's like, don't record me. So the family dogs I'm naked. begin to act really strange. <laughs> nah, with the doggo. Why are you running? Mostly nice. Dog's trying to protect her, bro. That dog's trying to protect her, bro. Don't go in there. Don't go in there. That's a nice house, though. What? What? Is this a new one? What's going on? <gasps> Another day, and Tasha is recording a candid video of her dogs to post to Snapchat when this happens. Oh, fuck no. No, it doesn't. Nothing happens. Look at them. Destroying the living see. room over one toy. I can't see. <laughs> I don't want to see. Silly. Right after posting the video to Snapchat, uh, a worried friend reaches out to Tasha to warn her about what seems to be a strange shadow-like figure moving up the wall right ooh. beside her dogs. Tasha has no idea what the creepy shadow could be, so she shares her story to TikTok, hoping to find answers. The video soon grabbed the attention of millions of concerned TikTok viewers who wonder if Tasha might have awakened a no. paranormal presence by renovating the 180-year-old farmhouse. And then, one night just after midnight, someone rings Tasha's doorbell. What? When she checks the security camera, what she sees chills her to her the core. Bar. Okay. Hmm. Who's ringing the doorbell? Who out there? What is that? Oh, that's... Oh, that's... Oh, no. It's outside. No, the ghost is outside, boys. A dark shadow can be seen moving towards the outside deck chair and appears to just take a seat. 
It then gets up, moves away towards the right, and disappears. That's crazy. So Natasha and her family move into a haunted farmhouse. First off, okay, first off. Be upsetting I like how you brought the husband, but doesn't mention him again. Lingering what does the husband think? Presence, causing it to I'm interested. Out. Let me know what you I'm think. I'm interested. Imaginary friend. Of course. A woman from Oregon says that her young daughter claims that there is something living in their basement. Hiding in the storage area just underneath oh, the stairs. Man. At first, of course, the mother dismisses these claims, just thinking it's the little girl's overactive imagination. Right, what did you? But that oh. same day, after hearing something strange coming from the basement, the right. mom decides to check the footage from their security camera. What that that she seems sees valid. That seems valid. Her to her core. core. Yeah, okay. Is that a hand? Run, bitch! Did you see it? A she said, small, "Bye." Hand can be seen reaching out from under the stairs before just disappearing. Even creepier, nope, nope, both nope, the nope, child nope, and the nope, family nope, cat nope, seem nope, to spot nope, this nope, bizarre nope, apparition. Nope, 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 the little girl nope. even seems to wave at something that we can't see. Imagine walking up. Nah, this this this, this is the shit that gets me. Walking up some stairs and and like there's a hole in the stairs and something grabs you by your foot. Was shared to the internet without a direct oh, source. God. So we'll probably I'd never scream. know. Like, what ah! happened to you. That's why I'd be like, what like ah! in the woods. Red keys are no recognition. I like the woods. The woods are the greatest. This video was caught on a trail cam, 20 miles out into the Idaho woods in the middle of nowhere. Of course. Now, there is no reason that anyone would be this far out in these isolated woods at this time of night. So what is this? <coughs> oh, why is he walking like that? Someone or something walks past a forest trail cam at 4.37 in the morning in the middle of the woods. Tweaker. In the middle of nowhere. Nah, it's a tweaker, bro. They have a bunker. Curious Reddit viewers point out that this strange humanoid so why don't they move? just looks kind of Facts. Off. You're they right. It's perhaps not even human at all. I mean, as it seems to have very... To be fair, to be honest, though, like, I, I don't know if... It depends on how severe the situation is for me. Because, like, pale skin. if I could live with it, I probably don't want to move because it costs so much money to move now. It costs so much money. I made bacon grilled. That sounds fire. You ever had a grilled cheese pizza? I'll have to send you a picture. In frail arms. A grilled cheese a pizza? Neck. That says fire. Now, is this a very lost and very strange person wandering around the remote woods of Idaho? Or is it something Yeah, my else? own concoction. I, I call it grilled cheese pizza. What's this? Lurking in the darkness. In the darkness, Now, course. this next extremely popular video was suggested so much probably close to a thousand times there was really no choice but to feature it here on nukes top five so dustin frazier says that he works the night shift at an allegedly haunted hotel in gatlinburg tennessee one yeah. night dustin is recording a snapchat video to send to his friend when something happens that makes his blood run cold i just got to work and uh I feel oh, excuse me like, excuse me like all day today, I felt bad. I'm in chilly tonight. Honestly, it's less like a little bit. I felt bad. Yeah. And. Whoa, what is that? What's that I sound? Just, like, I feel like I need to go to the doctor. But, it's like, sapping I'm his energy, bro. Nauseous. And. Yeah, I'm, it saps your energy, like, dude. I you gotta get out of there. To, <laughs> to like, take medicine for <laughs> it and stuff. <laughs> I, I don't know. It doesn't seem <laughs> like it really does anything. Um, Dude, why is it still talking? Yeah, if you wanted to swing by, don't swing by, uh, bro. He's dead. He's Red's dead. He's doomed. Hey, he's doomed. He's doomed, bro. He's sorry, dead, bro. He's he's, he's been marked. Hard. He's been like, marked, boys. I don't want to look. I don't want to look. Yeah. I gotta look away. Anyways. <laughs> oh God, he's been marked. Why is he still hey, going? Then, just leave. Just Stop. Good. Just do the recap. Just do the uh, recap, please. Yeah, I'm just chilling. Throughout the video, strange voices and whispers. He looks like shit. I felt bad. Honestly, it's less like it, a little dude, bad. It, it's like as the further he goes in, he looks more like to, shit. Like so this thing was. Thing. Oh my god. Um, and I also hate that they always keep this room so dark. Like, come on, man. 
creepiest of all, something can yeah. be seen standing in the shadows just That's behind death. Justin. Not once. That guy's gonna die. Twice. Twice. Some figure with a distorted skeletal face. Now, at the time I'm recording this story, this video nah, has nah, gained nah, a nah, massive nah, audience nah, nah, of nah, over nah, 19 nah. million viewers. Ain't no way that's real. Making it the most popular it must be fake. and most suggested video. But is it real? Or is it all just an elaborate hoax? You decide. We need scary videos. So if you see a scary video that you think would be <sighs> great on the top five, email us at nukestop5 at gmail.com. Caught on camera. Reddit user Justin says that he and his family recently bought and moved into a historic 1800s terrace house in London, England. But during renovations, Justin says his doorbell security camera caught something really creepy. All right, I'm gonna find our uh, spooky stuff for us. No, stop, no! Ew, what's that? Hold on. <laughs> oh no, Mojo. I don't know if I can handle that night. During the day, it's, I'm, I'm doing a okay. I'm doing a okay. I'm doing better than I did last night. Bro, what, dude? That's so weird. Why would it? Why? Around 10 p.m. at night, someone or something can be seen quickly taking just a peek at Justin's front door. Hey, what's good? And whoever Mark. or whatever it is appears to walk past the car <laughs> in the driveway actually got me. before disappearing off camera. Holy shit. The house I'm still thinking about the last history, video. Justin is worried that his renovations might have triggered some paranormal presence to act out. But worried Reddit viewers warn Justin that he might be dealing with something even scarier. A trespassing stranger that is scoping out his house for unknown reasons. Maybe so is this one a of the reasons could be just a robbery. Or is this a very real and potentially dangerous person? You decide. I don't know. It looks kind of frozen. In fear. In this creepy video, a woman oh, begins recording God, when her dog go. refuses to come back inside their house. Nope. The dog seems frozen in place and refuses to even look back at his owner as she calls to him. Oh no. Nigel, what are you doing? Why is he sitting like that? Why does it already look he looks so morphed? Nigel. Oh no. No, 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 no. Don't look. Why you gotta turn the corner, bro? Don't turn the corner. <laughs> the dog appears to be frozen in God fear damn as it stares it. at something behind the shed <laughs> in their backyard. When the woman slowly looks around the corner, her heart <laughs> almost stops as she sees two creepy glowing eyes staring right back It's at a bobcat, her. okay? Now the video abruptly ends here and was reposted to the internet by social media outlets that just don't bother to credit the source. So with no explanation, them out. it's hard to say exactly what's going on here. But it, the dog that's a cat, bro. That's a cat. Come on, look. Nation, it's hard to say exactly what's going on. Look, it, bro. You're telling me you don't see that? You don't see the fucking that the head right here and then the fucking body? That's a fucking cat. <coughs> on here but the dog a big ass cat reaction is strange no it's not it's just a cat he just so doesn't just what do you think this cat, dog bro? is seeing looking back from the darkness so he's probably he's probably protecting the 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 owner from the cat it's probably like a big ass cat first a young First. woman in Japan claims that her grandmother kept. I always got to bring up the fucking Japanese shit, bro. The cursed on. photo Stop. Album locked in one of her cupboards. The woman believes that. It's always the it's always the pale skin. It always was the pale skin mofos, man. Come on. Her grandmother might have dabbled in dark magic. Of course she dabbled in the juju, bro. Of course she and dabbled in the juju. Bro, and her grandmother's on. strange rituals might have led to her grandfather's strange, unexplained death twelve years earlier. Her grandfather allegedly took his own life inside the home, but the circumstances were very suspicious. The young woman says that for her part, she once viewed the cursed album herself, of but that she became seriously ill immediately afterwards. Oh, no. Why wouldn't you? Oh. Stop, I don't want to look at that. That could give me the bad juju. That could give me the bad juju. How's that curse actually? We're just 
Are they doing the oh since then the young woman's grandmother Nah, we're skipping this one. Nah, I'm good. We're skipping this one. Alright, here we go. Just like any other night of Canada on one of these it's out to a watcher in the woods. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm you skipping that one. The outdoors frequently. Now nah, that what scares okay. The shit that scares me the most on this shit is when they do the Japanese stuff because that shit actually creepy. He sets out to me the grudge in the night deep in the wilderness <coughs> of Canada. And I watched this shit when I was like trips, five. Sets up camp just like any so other I was scarred night. for life. He scouts through the woods with a flashlight and a GoPro camera. But this time something very unexpected happens and things take a creepy turn. Oh. Nah, 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 nah. Come on now. Oh! Oh, f oh hi. <laughs> huh? Why do you turn off the light? Oh, f oh hi. Is... <laughs> what the hell? Hold on, is, there, is it show anything? Does it show anything? Oh God! I'm gonna turn it down. I need to get out of here. Yeah, you do. Oh, get the fuck out. I sick. No, 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 no. That bitch sees you, bro. You gotta go. That was fucking creepy. He said. I need to get out of here. The camper thinks he hears movement in the remote woods, so he cuts his flashlight so he can't be seen. Okay. What? The joke is on him, because just then a high-pitched voice can be heard calling out, "I see you." I attempted it though. Oh, what the fuck? That's. Oh, hi. If something did that, I'd be, I'd be like, I'd be so scared. I'd piss myself, man. I'd be so scared. Stalking him in the dark woods, he decides to just quickly head back to the safety of his camp. The experienced explorer says this is the scariest sound he's ever heard in the woods. Even though he was somewhere deep in the Canadian wilderness and completely removed from any towns or cities, he says that he hopes that the voice belonged to just a fellow camper having a laugh. You can watch this entire video on our YouTube channel. I see you. 